Hold it, people! Hold it! I'm back! Someone, please help me! I am in need of a handsome young gentleman! Yo, you! Yes! You there, and the striped pants! You magnificent beast! Yes! Oh ho ho ho! Yes! You look like you'll do just fine! Of course, he's talking to Hero. Huh? Uh, wow! Uh, Oh, I thank you. I don't know what to say. Please, kind sir, will you help out a poor, lowly mole? I am desperately in need of your service. Well, since you ask so nicely, how can I refuse? Thank you. Thank you, young lad. You are too generous. Please, come this way now. Chop, chop. Wait, hold on. Can't my friends come too? I guess your friends. You're all here to see Sweetheart's Quest, yes? If so, you will all meet again soon enough. Now come, sir. We must make haste. Time is short. Cool. <laughs> You're just fucked off, I guess. Uh, can I get on stage? No? Can I take the mic? Alright. Oh, he's contestant three. He's contestant three. Hero's already gonna be a contestant. Yeah, cause Snaily got fucking blown to smithereens. Greetings, sweetheart fans! We apologize for the short intermission. Welcome back to our regularly scheduled program. During the break, we regret to inform you that a tragic accident has occurred right here on this very stage. God damn it. It is at this time we announce the sudden loss of contestant number three. We will remember him fondly for the few seconds that we got to know him. He was truly a unique and irreplaceable soul. Irreplaceable you say? Well we already replaced him with someone. But the show must go on! Please give a warm welcome to our new contestant number three! Hailing all the way from the vast forest! It's our hero in shining armor! Let's go, hero! Oh no, he's shitting his pants. Get this, guys. Hero's a real hunk, standing at a whopping 5'7! His passions include baking, cooking, and cleaning. And if that doesn't sound like the perfect man, check out his killer smile and mild personality. And now, once again, it's time to introduce the star of the show! Dim the lights, please! She emits beauty. She exudes grace. She truly has the most pulcherit... Pulcheritudinous. The most polka... Google, help me out here. The most... Pulcheritudinous. Face! Thank you very much, Google. Yes! You know who we're talking about. She's all that is amazing and wonderful, and she is just about to set foot on this very stage. She's the one, the only, the magnificent. Oh! 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 An excellent entrance, my liege! Ah, yes! It is me! Hello, my stupid, adoring fans! We love you, sweetheart! Yeah, you're the best! Oh! Sweetheart, we have brought three of the best bachelors in the world onto this stage. Will today be the one that one of them steals your heart? Let's start with some questions! One thing that Sweethearts values most in a companion is complete and absolute obedience! Do you, Contestant 1, agree to pledge your allegiance to Sweetheart for the rest of your life? Contestant 1, what is your answer? Uh, sure? I don't know, I guess? Playing hard to get, I see. What do you think about that response, Sweetheart? Hmm, 
just three feet tall? My, that is much too short. Send them off to the dungeon. Hey, what do you say? The, the dungeon? Oh my lord. You heard it here first, folks. Dungeon for contestant number one. Help me! Now, on to contestant number two. We ask you the same question. There's no right or wrong answer. Just answer truthfully. Contestant number two, will you pledge your allegiance to Sweetheart for the rest of your life? Well, um, sure. If that means I won't get sent to the dungeon. My word, this one, his very being offends me. Take him away, boys. <laughs> Man just booked it. He even dropped the mic. Ah, oh, contestant number three. It looks like you're the last one standing. I'll ask the same question one more time. Again, no pressure at all. Do you, hero, agree to pledge your allegiance to Sweetheart for the rest of your life? Hero's not happy. He's not taking it. Well, no. That doesn't seem fair at all. Why would I do that? Oh shit. Oh shit. My! This one! He's absolutely immaculate! Could it be? Is Sweetheart in love? What an exciting turn of events! This must be fate! A match made in heaven! Wait, but I just said! Ah, yes! Yes! You'll do just fine! Now, what was your name again? Uh-huh! It's, uh, it's Hero, ma'am. Hero! My hero! We must go to my chambers at once! Guards! I have chosen my suitor! Take him away! Uh... uh guys! Oh, please! Do something! Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go! Whoa! Hero's gonna marry Sweetheart? I didn't see that one coming at all! Kel, what are you saying? We have to help him. What do you want me to do about it? I don't want to go to the dungeon. Ugh, Kel, you're so useless. Hero, you have to reject Sweetheart. It's time. Oh, wait, no, wrong person. It's time, Hero. Your princess awaits. Oh! Um, I don't think she's going to listen to me. Just do it already! Uh, okay, I'll try. Alright, let's go. Excuse me, uh, sweetheart, ma'am? Ah, yes, my lovely hero. How I yearn for the sound of your sweet voice. Say my name again. Wow, <laughs> that's so nice of you. I mean... Uh, why do I have to do this? Ahem. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but I'm not interested. Why, whatever do you mean, my prince? I, um, this is all really flattering and all, but, you know, we only just met like a few moments ago and... Well, I have to reject your, um, offer? Oh, pish posh. Don't be silly, hero. I've never heard anything sillier. It... it's true. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but... I... don't... want... to marry you. Uh-oh. Fuck. Fuck, fuck. Hero, run! Book it! Run! <laughs> this... this is preposterous. No, this, this is blasphemy! You dare reject Sweetheart? Everyone loves Sweetheart, you hear me? Everyone! Send them off to the dungeon! Hey, stop right there! You can't take Hero, he belongs to us! What's this now? 
is the, what is a non sweetheart fan doing in the audience? Ah, I see. You must be Hero's fans. The nerve of you lot. First you make a fool out of me, then you interrupt me during my own show? I'm the one who makes the rules around here. Guards, take them away. Uh-oh, now you've done it, Aubrey. What, we're not going to fight? We're not going to give him a good old beating? Why are we stuck in the dungeon? Aw, oh, man. Now we're all stuck in the dungeon. Sorry, guys. It's my fault that we're all in this mess. No, it's not, Hero. No one could have predicted that would happen. Oh! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> you fools! Don't you recognize me? Oh my god, it's Rosa. It's me, Rosa! The number one sweetheart fan in the world. I told you that you'd all pay for crossing me. Curses, we've been bamboozled. I should have known you were behind this, Rosa. It's true what they say. Revenge is sweet! Now rot, you peons! Rot in the dungeon forever! Oh! <laughs> Dang it! How are we ever gonna get out of here? We'll find a way! Uh, come on, guys! Let's think about this! Where do we even start? It's not like they just leave the gate unlocked, would they? Well, one way to find out. God damn it! Of course they will leave it unlocked. This looks like a job for Aubrey! Also, screw you, Sprout Mole. Harold? Who do you think you are, Harold? I think you're Harold Dunn, if that makes any sense. I know it doesn't, but who the fuck cares? You are going to mess for putting me in a dungeon. Right in the heart, baby! Oh, now you decide to level up to level 17, huh? It's about fucking time. Alright. Aubrey. You know what to do. Nope. 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 Well, I guess it could have been worth a shot. What do we have over here? A trap door? Oh, lord. Uh, I'll look at this later. But first... I'm almost positive there's some ramen in here. Yep, some to some good old toilet bowl ramen. I also heard that there was a dungeon sprout mole over here. Suck it, Harold. If I have to kill you again, I'll do it. Alright then. Hello, glowing eyes. Oh, Lord. Who are you? Marsha? The axe-wheeling sprout mole? Get the hell out of here! Right in the heart, baby! Oh, man, right in the heart! We're getting all sorts of crits! Let's go! And we're also getting some good XP. Ah, uh, the gate won't budge. Raw, a special hell for you, my dear. Signed SHW. Where for. What? Okay, it's not gonna allow me to go there. Okay, good. I'm, I'm kind of glad it doesn't allow me to go there, cuz... Yay, Tofu! Kind of glad it doesn't allow me to go there, or else I know I would just fuck up and like shit my pants or something like that. The Royal Bath. Reminder, the pool must be refilled regularly. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Alright, Kel. You know what to do? Let's go, baby! I'm nasty! Alright, what do we have over here? Cardboard boxes for no other reason than to take up space. Oh, come on, there has to be, like... Oh, cool. It's just more sweetheart music. But there has to be, like, some place where I can get, like, a fucking book or whatnot. An interesting book. Come on now. 
I guess we'll listen to some sweetheart in the sweetheart dungeon. Seems only fitting, does it not? Okay. That one doesn't open. And looks like we have Marsha again. Yep, sorry Marsha, but you're toast. Tofu. Nothing. Nothing. Prepare press this. Thank you very much. More sprout moles. Oh no! What are we gonna do? No one ever skips the dungeon! Both contestants. Another trapdoor? Shit, I didn't want to go through this trapdoor actually. It is not alive. What the hell was that? He protected himself from what? So my god, that's a lot of clams. Damn, I'm now tempted to make everyone happy again, but I really don't want to get fucking crit in the heart. And this one won't budge either. Alright, if none of these are going to budge, then it's time for Trapdoor. Well, it looks like there's a switch over there, but I guess can't go through it. What's up, my guy? Huzzah! After countless failures, I finally almost made my escape! All I need to do now is find the exit. Well, um... Buddy, can you, can you, uh, can you move? Can you please move? Uh, I need you to move, buddy! Oh my god, really? The switch is right there. It's right there. Oh, would you look at that? Alright. I'll take that. Maybe not, maybe not. Uh, what about down here? Doesn't look like I can really do anything about it. Doesn't this lead me back to the... Yeah, it leads me back to the toilet. So... It's not in my best interest to continue on from here. Come on, bro! Fuck off! Shite! Bro, I literally have no clue where I'm supposed to go! How retarded am I? Where's the next gate that I can go through? Where's the next button? Mario's right there. I just... Buddy, can you please fuck off? I, there's the switches right there. I'm gonna need you to move, pal. What? 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 Hey, it's Mari! 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 Help us! We're stuck in the dungeon! Oh no! Oh my god, I really just had to come all the way down here. There you go! Now come here and enjoy a nice picnic with me. I promise you'll feel better right away. Thanks, Mario. You're a saint. The real question is, how did you get down here in the dungeon? How? <laughs> and is that a jar of pickles that I see? Yep, it's a jar of pickles. Hero, I have a question for you. Was there any chance in the world that you would have said yes to marrying Sweetheart? What? No way! You know I only have eyes for you, Mari. Ew! Ew is right, Cal. Hero, that's not what I like about you at all. What? It's not? Then what is it? I can't tell you that, silly. It would ruin the magic. Okay. I don't really get it. Whatever you say. Mari! You don't have to worry about Sweetheart at all. Sweetheart is the worst. I can't imagine anyone being in love with her. Wasn't she with Captain Space Boy, though? Hmm. Relationships like that are just shallow. You can't compare it to the real deal, like what me and Omori have. Isn't that right, Omori? Omori? Yep, silent protagonist. I'm, um... I'm just not gonna say anything about it. But wait, the better question is... Are you telling me that Omori, or I guess Sunny, had a thing for Aubrey? How sweet. 
All right. Uh, 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 uh. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Tofu! I got sent to the dungeon for smuggling, but all habits die hard. That said, I got some choice goods for sale, Patron. Interested in buying? All right, smuggler gash, what do you got? Mango smoothies, interesting. Poetry books, life gems. This all seems good and all, but I think I'll pass. Well, there's one part done, I guess. But this really isn't gonna lead me anywhere, is it? I need to go over here. What does this place have for me in store? Oh lord! We got two dead bodies over here. They are, in fact, not alive. I've been stuck down here for so long, I can barely move a muscle. My G, you don't even have muscles! Eh? What's that face for? <laughs> you don't have muscles! Oh, would you look at that? Looks like the F key. And more toilet ramen. Gotta love me some good old toilet ramen. Oh, wait, no, that's not the F key. What the f What the hell is that then? Loser! Loser! Oh, shit. Alright, Harold, you asked for it. Alright, what do we have over here? It looks like the I key. So I lit. I, where's the G key? Where the fuck could the G key be? Is I? No, I is in the right one. Within a large frame, beneath a trap door. A trap door, but where? Lying in a dark cell, trapped in a pink cage. Ah, damn it. Where the where the hell could where the hell could the G key be? Wait a minute. Just to be sure, the G key is not the little door that the gators were guarding back in the junkyard, right? Because if so, then I need to figure out how to get there ASAP. Also, the better question is, I still have no fucking clue what this spells out. Uh, I'm gonna assume this last word is space? I believe? Who knows? Alright, what do we have here? A whole bunch of jars that needs some smacking. Alright, and we have kale over here. Yes sir, let's go baby. Come on. Okay, poor Sprum all over there just blew up. I thought it was, I think it was gonna fuck off, but I guess not. Oh my god, I'm so close to the entrance. I can almost feel it. I can almost taste it. I can almost smell it. I can almost feel it. Like it's magic in my bones. And what do you have over here? More tofu? More tofu? All right, am I? Is this the right way? Two clams? Two clams? I don't think this. Thirty? My lord! I should have gone here years ago. Two hundred fifty clams. Clams galore! Anyway, what's, what does this other gate do? Whoa. Uh, sure, I'll take that. Oh, would you look at that? They're back again. Oh, but they're empty. Wait, no, they're not empty. Never mind. I still get more clams. Let's go. <laughs> I'm rich. Look there. We're finally at the exit. Woohoo. Freedom at last. Let's get out of here. I never want to see another sprout mole again in my life. Uh... Actually, I just I just had a theory not a game theory per se, but That last button that we What the hell how do I open that last button then? What about this one no no God damn it. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons 
What about this one? I have a bad feeling about this. Alright, this freedom at last? Oh my lord. Sweetheart's castle. Uh oh. This isn't where I should be coming from. Why is the dungeon fabulous? Hold, prisoners! Do you really think you could escape that easily? It's back to the dungeon for you four. Darn! And we were so close too! Uh oh, what do we do now? Think, hero, think! Come on, how do we get out of this? Oh, I got it! <laughs> the nice disguise, hero. Ahem! On the contrary, Sir Knight, I think you have mistaken us for someone else. Mm hmm, yes. Ahem! <laughs> Don't be so quick to judge. We are sprout moles, uh, undubitably. Oh, indeed. Ah, yes, quite. I am also a lover of tofu and sweetheart. Mmm, delicious sweet. Uh, I mean tofu. Yeah, my eyes must have deceived me. I apologize, brethren. It is rather hard to see through this helmet. Very well, carry on then. I will resume my patrol. You lot ought to return to your stations as well, lest our dear sweetheart notices. How's that for some quick thinking? That was so smooth, hero! With these sprout mole masks, we'll be able to make it out of here in a cinch! Do we really have to keep wearing these, hero? Mine is getting kind of itchy. Yes, Kel, we should keep them on until we get out of here. Come on, let's move. Alright, I think I'm gonna leave it off for today, so if you liked the video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. My name is Pixel Love, and I will see you lot in the next episode. Take care, everybody.